several cars out starting their morning early, and they're probably bundled up. It is 36 degrees here in the metro area. Here's Byron with your forecast. That's right, Sasha. A chilly morning, but we'll reverse those numbers. It'll be 63 by the afternoon here in the metro, which is a good 14 degrees above average. Look at this, the tram cam. You see that windsock there is extended, and that is because we have some wind in the mountains and also across the eastern part of the state for today. That will bring some fire danger to, to the eastern part of the state. Couple storm systems ahead. This is good news because they have the potential to bring some showers as we head through the next several days. Let's hope for that moisture. We desperately need it across all parts of the state. A dry day in Albuquerque today. Temperatures for the 40s at 9 o'clock in the morning into the 60s by the afternoon. Again, that's well above average. And we'll have a bit of a breeze here out of the west northwest, about 10 to 15 miles per hour, but a stronger wind mountains into the eastern part of the state and that's where we have that fire danger so a heightened fire threat avoid all burning for today look at the temperatures in the east for today 67 las vegas 70 in santa rosa 78 roswell tomorrow how about 47 las vegas and santa rosa 52 in roswell so a big cool down in the eastern part of the state for tomorrow albuquerque a little cool down for tomorrow and then we're going to see that storm system work in by tuesday and i think we'll see that chance of some rain and snow showers across northern parts of the state on tuesday with this system it looks pretty weak but a stronger system is on the way by friday into saturday and it's that system that has a better chance of bringing some Definitely needed rain and mountain snow to New Mexico. I think here in Albuquerque, we even have the potential of some snow showers Friday night into Saturday morning here in Albuquerque and highs only in the lower 40s.